Hey guys, welcome back. I know it's been a long time. We are, uh, or I am here at uh, Lake Wadawi by myself for the first time this year. And I, there's nothing else like this, guys. I just, I love it. I love it. You know, man, I just, uh, I'd rather be by myself fishing than anything, man. I just, it's peaceful. You, you, it's, it's just great. But anyway, enough with the gooshy stuff. Uh, Lake Wadawi, I'm going to be throwing a jerk bait, Spro Little John. I got a, uh, a wacky rig set up. I got a uh, um, six cents, yes, I said it, six cents jerk bait, six cents jig, and a six cents frog. Guys, the more I look at their baits, they're just amazing. I mean, they're just amazing products. Well thought out, well designed, man. I mean, it's just uh, uh, six cents. I'm, I am testing the waters, guys. So, all right, I'm gonna put my chesty on, and uh, we're gonna go over here and hit this uh, hit this wall and uh, see what's happening. We're up here on Lake Wadawi. And guys, I am on the, I guess you'd call it the northern end of the lake. Uh, the top side of the lake. Uh, I've put in somewhere totally different. The bottom side of this lake I know very, very well. But I wanted to go somewhere and do something. Uh, get Be a little challenging. You know, see, see if I can uh, figure some stuff out today. Every video that I've shot, which I know hadn't been many, I've always used Guggen baits, Patriot Custom Baits, and I'll throw a uh, Rapala Shad Wrap from time to time. And uh, so this trip is all about six cents. I probably won't throw anything but that today. Well, hard bait wise, I, I don't have any of their soft plastics yet. On the jerk bait, guys, on the jerk bait. Look at that. Get up in here. Get up in here. Boy, he got him hemmed up, don't we? <laughs> him all hemmed up. On the jerk bait. Six cents jerk bait, baby. Wow. Look at that. Let me get that out of you. Let me get that out of you so you're not hurting. There's number one. First one. On the jerk bait. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. Wow. That is my first fish I've ever caught off a of jerkbait, guys. First time. All right, guys. I'm just putting along the scene. Bait fish popping the water up here. Got him, guys. He's running towards me, too. Wow, 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 wow. I knew he'd... Oh, a little bitty thing. That's all right. That's all right. That's all right. What you gonna do? What you gonna do here? Oh, boy. Got him in the nostrils. Good deal, man. Right there. Sorry about that, buddy. And the bait fisher. Oh my gosh, they're right here. They're right here. Makes me feel bad when I do something like that. He'd already been called a couple of times. Gosh, look at this. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at this. Look at this. They're everywhere. Guys, are y'all seeing this? Wow. Got him. No. Come on, man. Come on. Thank you. 
right, guys, it is uh, about 12 o'clock. We've got, we've caught four of them. Uh, as you've seen, three small ones on a jerk bait, and um, one decent one, maybe a two pounder on a two and a half pounds on a swim jig. I'm going to um, start focusing on this, uh, these points right here, and uh, drop offs and see uh, see what we can find. See if we can find anything. Still gonna throw the swim jig, but I'm going to uh, start throwing that sprawl a little bit more, and maybe my jerk bait um, a little bit more. So uh, I'm sitting in five foot of water right now. I'm gonna circle out and try to fish this this little bit of a drop off right here. Hopefully, man, we'll catch some more. right here in front of us. Number six on the jerk bait. Wow. Thank you, buddy. Guys, what I've done is I tried on Another jerk bait. Put on a spinning rod. I can just work it a lot better, man. I do not like it on that medium heavy. Number seven on the provoke. Settle down, man. Right in front of the dock. Small, small, but number seven on the provoke. Thank you, buddy. What, what's up with this thing? Why is it going all for? that jerk baked in your hand. Mm. You know, guys, ooh. What is that? Number eight, again, a small one, but at least we are catching them. A big, big one's got to be around somewhere. Got him. Oh, this is a little bit better. Maybe not, though. He's coming straight towards me. Ah. There's number 10.
There's number 10. Thank you, buddy. Uh-oh, my knot looks like it is wore completely out here, guys. Let me look at something. That's all right. There's number 10 on the Provoke. Maybe they're about to start biting really good. Come on, big chunga. Got another one, guys. About the same size. Boy, that jerk bait scares me. Oh, got another one. That's a little bit better one, guys. Just a little bit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's a decent one. Ah. All right, guys, that's 14. Glad I didn't hurt him. Oh my gosh. Well, that was over a cable. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. My jerk bait, my jerk bait. Uh oh, my knot looks like it is wore completely out here, guys. Let me look at something. It floats. I think it does. Yeah, there it is. Came back and got that. Look at that one. Look at that one, guys. That's a good one. Thank you, buddy. One more time there for the camera. Good one. On the jig. On the jig. Look at my graph, guys. I just threw my jig out there on top of that. We need to mark that, don't we? Let it drop. All right, guys, <clears throat> a couple more spots, it's 4.30. We haven't caught nothing in about two hours now. We're gonna throw a jig down through here. Of course, the um, jig spinner bait. And of course, the provoke. 17 fish today. I ain't been no size, but and I'm down to one camera. I've exhausted all of my batteries except the one that's on the chesty. 
we're back up here close to where we started, close to the boat ramp. This one, trying to give it just a little bit more time, hoping them shad will start hitting top of the water in these coves again. <laughs> 